So this is my my old bike, my my primary bike. Uh, it's a Roadmaster Mount Sport SX. It's a 21 speed mountain bike. It's got a suspension front fork, which is really nice. Shimano shifters. I've had it for 15 years. I bought it new and ended up adding a rack to it and wiring a crate to that rack. It's great, uh, except that you know I'm getting older now. I don't really ride on trails too much anymore, and. Uh, riding bent over like you have to in order to have your hands on the handlebars it's just kind of it's not working for me so much anymore so I found this bike which is nice it's a uh, it's a Huffy Santa Fe uh, I cleaned up pretty nice once I got it um, put on a new seat added the bell because I love them classic bells uh, it's got the fenders which is great you can ride it in the rain or I should say on wet roads uh, the color is interesting. It's this kind of metallic purple. It's got these pretty metallic flakes that kind of come out in the sun. Not really the most eye-catching thing. Uh, I had to put new hand grips on it, new seat, like I said. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's older. It's getting some rust in places. Um, it's got one speed and a coaster brake, which is great for the sake of simplicity. Um, but simplicity is also limiting. So, my new baby is this guy here. This is a Schwinn Point Beach 7-speed cruiser with hand brakes, built-in rack. Real classy, real eye-catching. Again, I added a little bell because I love that classic bell show you it's it's a wonderful bike it's the most expensive bike I've ever owned it cost about two hundred dollars I just got it two days ago I've turned it around here so that you can really see how it shines in the Sun it's just beautiful it's eye-catching that red and white I, I just I just love it absolutely love it I like the uh, you know like like the other bike it's got the white wall tires fenders painted fenders not chrome which I think is just classy. It's got a two-tone seat, which is okay. Uh, it's white and black. I think a previous year's model had white and brown, which I think I'd like better, but that's okay. White and red would look even better, but that's okay. It's all right. I'm gonna show you some of the things that I really like about this bike. Again, just like my other one, it's got uh, it's got an index shifter. Now the shifter here is uh, kind of a rubbery feel, which is very comfortable, very nice, and it's very, very crisp. I like that a lot. I like the uh, the hand grips are nice and comfortable. They're rubber, of course. Well, you'd think, of course, but I had a Santa Fe once for a short time that actually had foam that spanned the entire handlebars. I hated that. It felt cheap. This thing, not at all. I love the rack. I love the paint on it. This beautiful red and white paint. I, I even like the way the reflector is mounted to the rack. You see that, uh, what would we call that, uh, that arrowhead design is kind of carried out throughout the bike. It's pretty much everywhere. It's on the down tube, what do we call that? It's on the front of the forks on the tips of the fenders. Yeah, I just love this thing. So, what do I love? I love the shifter. I love the brakes. I love the paint. I love the white wall tires. It's not all perfect, though. There's a couple things I don't love so much. I don't like the pedals. They're cheap plastic affairs that I'm going to replace very soon. Um, they're the right type of pedal. They sort of resemble the old the old ones that had a steel cap back here and two rubber blocks in here, but they're just molded plastic and they're, they're cheap and I don't like them. I also don't like the front reflector mount. They're going with these increasingly. It's this cheap plastic thing that goes onto the it goes around the uh, the handlebar instead of being mounted to the stem with a proper metal bracket. So I'm going to find a proper metal bracket and mount a uh, 
deflector up front like that because that's the way it ought to be. But apart from that, and those are very tiny concerns, I absolutely love this thing. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Rides nicely. Um, when you're freewheeling, it does kind of make a bit of noise. Uh, more than I'd expect, but, you know, whatever. So, yeah, so that's, that's the bike, man. Schwinn Point Beach. You can read that, but you probably can't. A uh, seven-speed cruiser. Look at the way the sun just gleams on that, that, that red paint. It's like iridescent metallic. I don't know how you describe it exactly, but it's just lovely. All right, I'm off. Take a ride.